Oh, my God. Matt Veavena, have you started running in the mornings? Have you decided to improve your health? He's back. He's back. Who's back? What are you talking about? Lyosha's is back. What do you mean? We're in trouble. Can you believe there are no tickets for the return flight from Warsaw? I don't even know how I'll get there. Sasha, aren't you tired of driving back and forth? Nakira, come to breakfast. I'm sick of it. I wanted to talk to you about it, by the way. Go ahead. Let's go home with you. What do you mean? I mean to the farm in the village. After my father's death, there's no owner there. And my father created it from scratch. You can't just sell it. So don't sell it. Let Andre, your brother, do it. He's there on the spot. He doesn't have to travel between two countries. What kind of farmer is Andre? He dreams of moving to the city. What kind of a farmer are you? And a guy? Well, I thought you'd support me. Wait, are you serious? Yes. Forgive me for reminding you. But you have a contract with a solid European firm. And I have a job I love. My junior girls are already entered in the European Championships. Nikita's school, by the way. You know he got the highest grade in Polish? And now guess the right answer to the question. What did we all forget in the village of Werbulivka? Maybe it's not quite like that. It's a very promising business and I'll find a job there in my profession. You see, I want to make a smart farm. You can imagine everything is computerized. I'm late for practice. Nakira, go eat. Food is already cold. Mom, Dad, why are you making so much noise? Is something wrong? Your dad got nostalgic. I thought we had at least 20 years to go, but no, the call of the ancestors. I don't understand your categorization. You don't? No. I don't understand. But this is my chance to realize my dream. What about me? What I want? Great talk. Nakira, I'm waiting for you in the car. Okay. Well, what do you think, young man? Dad, if my opinion really matters, I'm not crazy about this idea either. I'm sorry. I got it. I'm out of here. Well done. You can go change. Let's get the little ones ready. Did he just say go to the farm? Yeah. That's cool. I can't even imagine how he could think of something like that. Maybe he has some good reasons. Like what? 
For a man, realization is like going after a mammoth and getting it. Sophia, what mammoth? It's the 21st century, and then we have shot enough of these mammoths in the last 10 years. Well, you go start training. I'll be right back. Good girl. Good afternoon. The called party's cell phone is switched off or out of range. Nakita, finish it. I'll be right back. I'm just passing the level. Well, did you get through? No, now I'll call Uncle Andre. Hello. Hello, Andre. Hi. Is everything all right there? Yes, everything's fine, though, Sasha just arrived and went straight to work, why? Nothing, I'm just worried, he's not answering his phone. Don't worry, he forgot his phone in the office, he'll call back. If you see him before, tell him to call back, okay? No problem, okay, let's go, bye. Vo, bye. Andre? What's wrong? Hello? Olga? Sasha drowned. Is this a joke? They found his body in the lake at Zivi Kluki. The same place where his father died. Vo, Olya, I don't understand what happened. Olya, Alia. Mom. Sasha, no. Sasha. Calm down. Sasha, no. Thank you. How are you? I don't know. Thank you for letting me bury Sasha here, next to my parents. We had a fight before the flight. You wanted to come back and stay? I'm not. That's how it turned out. He came back and stayed. Olga, I realize this question is inappropriate, but you're leaving now and I need to understand what's going to happen to the farm. Andre, I'm begging you, please, not now. You're the direct heir. Sasha had 50%. Oh, that's what you mean. I don't need the farm. 
Why don't you think about it? No, I've decided everything. This farm was created by your father. So prepare the documents. I'll sign everything. Okay, I'll do it. Polenka. You hang in there. You have Nikita. Thank you. Thank you, too. Andrei Gorevic? Yes. What is it? What do you mean? Well, with the farm, people are asking. They're nervous. I don't know yet. Are they don't understand? They all have families, children. I know. So tell them that I'll be the only owner of the farm. Let them calm down. The wages will remain the same. Are you sure? Olga doesn't need a farm. It's good that she doesn't. Siyanku Barzo. I don't like the way you look. I don't like myself. Have you been to the doctor? Yes. He prescribed me pills for depression. Are they working? No. And Nikita? Nikita. Nikita's better than me. It seems to me that he's resigned. And I realize that nothing will happen, and this knowledge turns me into emptiness. Everything will be but without him. I don't need anything without him. I keep thinking why he went into that lake. The police gave you an official answer. Yes. No traces of alcohol, no violence, nothing was found. He just decided to go swimming in October, do you believe that? I'm sorry. Yes, Andre. Oh, I forgot. Andre, can I do this remotely? I understand. Okay, I'll fly in, I'll buy the ticket and I'll call you. Bye. Who's that? It's Sasha's brother. I have to fly there to sign the inheritance documents to transfer my share to Andre. It's good. Not that you're giving up the inheritance, but that you have a chance to say goodbye and start living again. You think? I'm telling you. What's up? It's okay. She hasn't changed her mind. She'll come. I can't believe we're gonna be full farm owners. Listen, I recently saw a story. There is a complete automation of feed. I'm selling the farm. How do you sell? To whom? To Kapilov. Why? Because I didn't like doing it. And I don't want to do it. Wait, why am I the last who know about it? Why last? First, he just agreed to buy it yesterday. Of course he didn't. We're almost bankrupt. It's a great opportunity to buy a farm for a penny. He's giving a good amount of money. Are you really going to give birth to cows for the rest of your life? That's not the point. What is it? I wanted to, but how can you not understand family, children? We don't have kids, Yulia, well. I'm sorry. I did not want to offend you. But you know, the more money, the more chances to get pregnant. Yes. I have to go to work. I have to meet a notary. Bye.
Yes, yes. Bon appetite. Hi. So I've audited the farm of the Chorus brothers. We need 10 more hectares. 10. 10. Where can we get it? Well, let's say we have them. How long before we reach zero? Given all the risks, at best, a year and a half. A year and a half. I'll talk to Ivanovich about the land. We'll try to find it. We should not try. We should find it. Otherwise, sales will have to be reduced. The client will leave. You can't get him back, you know. I understand. I'll decide. Serioga? Why didn't you bargain with Forrest? Under their circumstances, he would give up 20% and maybe even more. I don't want to. I don't like that. Suit yourself. Okay, I'm waiting for an answer on the ground and once again I'll summarize everything. Goodbye. Goodbye. Okay, Ivanovich. Hello, Ivan Ivanovich. This is Kapilov. Well, what are we all about us? How are you here? We're fine too. Yulka made breakfast. Waiting for us at home. Andre, let's stop by Sasha's cemetery on the way. Okay. Let's go. Young man, let me pass. Take your time, man. Your office isn't going anywhere. What are you doing? What do you want? Let's go. Let's go. Strange. I remember everything differently. It's my dad's innovations. After he came back from you, he said, I want everything like in Europe. He made a deal with the head, so they put things in order together. There are still a few old houses in the forest, where grandmothers are still living. Mostly farm workers settled there with their families. The kindergarten and the school were cleaned up. See, mom, and you thought it was horrible. Let's go. Hi. Thank you. Nakito, go help. Yulika, hi. What are you doing here? Nothing. I'm just going through my closet. Soon you won't be able to fit into anything. What will we tell people? Why should I tell them anything? Who cares? Don't make a fool of yourself. Not many people like us anyway. You'll be ashamed of yourself. I'll get over it. Come on. Are you still nauseous? I've collected something here. Especially for you. Drink it at night, and in the morning, it'll help. They say Sasha's wife is here. She's here. But why are you so happy? It's not good. Stop it. You're in trouble. Everything is for the dead. She'll sign the documents, and everything will be fine. If she signs. Understand? What did you say? Try this. I made it myself. This is from cow's milk, and this is from goat's milk. I've recently made hard cheeses, and now I'm waiting to see if it works or not.
It's really good. Nakira, put the phone down, try it. Yeah, I'll just set up the WIFI. What do you mean? It's not working, we agreed. Okay, when will you be back? Wait. So what am I supposed to do now? I'll take care of it, goodbye. What happened? The notary is strange, mumbles half of the words I can't understand, he's gone. It's nothing. Wait, how are we going to sign everything now? Can you stay a couple more days? I'll take care of everything. I didn't count on it. I got work. Nikita's got school. Oh, I'm hooked up. Finally, some decent internet speed. Mom, what's going to happen to this school a day? Two still do not solve anything. Well, is there any decent hotel here? Don't you want to stay in your house? What house? Well, Sasha built a house for you. He was going to move out himself, didn't he tell you? No. He probably wanted to surprise me. Well, if you don't want to stay in your house, stay with us. We have plenty of space. No, we'd rather stay in the house. In our own house. Julia, bring the keys. They're in the drawer in the desk. There are keys to the gate to the house and the car in the garage, by the way. You can see the house from here. If you want, I can take you there. No, I think we'll get there on our own. But I hope we don't have a house in the form of a cube. Then I'll take the keychain. Yes, mum, well, that is certainly good. To build such a house and never once plow. Yes. A house with big windows and a high porch, like I wanted. He didn't drown himself. He had help. What? They were disturbed. The woodsman came back. He took the father. He took the son. He spared no one. Granny. There was death. There will be death. He won't spare anyone. He'll take everyone. I'm sorry. It's my grandmother. She's crazy. She scares everyone. Let's go home. Sorry again. It's okay, I understand. Why did you go to her? Why are you meddling? It's true, people say you're a witch. I'm a witch? And what do you call it, making love to a strange man? I'll take care of it myself. The main thing is to have someone to deal with. And then do as you please. Well, at last there's a holiday on our street too. What are you talking about? Nobody knows. Come on, tell us. We have work to do. They're selling us out. Selling us to who? How do you know? The Kapilovs confirmed it. Serioga Kapilov decided to buy our farm. So what happened? Why aren't you there? Viktor Oligovic, they say our farm is being sold. This is the first time I've heard of it. It's true. My husband is selling the farm. Is it for sure? Unfortunately, yes. The deal was supposed to take place today, but there's something with the notary, so it was postponed for a while. You're working. Let's go. Milka should be calving there. We have to get everything ready. I'll wait for you at 1800 at our place.
かせまあせつへエブリティングオーケーイエスディジュセイソンティングイセッアンガナビインドゥルムアクロスダホールオーケーはい。This is the last time I'm in the office. Thank God. Parking genius. What are you doing? What am I doing blocking half the street with my hearse? Couldn't you wait five minutes? Listen, sir, what's your name? Sergey. Sergey, I honked at you. I tried to pass you, no reaction. I was in the shower. I had to run out to you naked. You should park properly, then you won't have to run. Young lady, there's another house and a cul de sac. Nobody drives here but me. This is my house, and now I'll be driving here. So I advise you to park not across, but along the street. I know, and you, honey. Don't yell, it gives women wrinkles. Rude. Psychopath. Nakira. Can you hear me? I'm going to Uncle Andre now, then to the notary. Okay. There's food in the fridge. Can I sleep? It's the roosters and you. Hi. Hi. Good health, get on that baby now. Where's Andre? She's at the notary's to check the documents. Innocently killed? Innocently. I don't know what you mean. Sorry, we're in a hurry. Listen, who's that? Grandma Gena, the local madwoman. The villagers think she's a witch. She came yesterday too, talking about some innocent murdered man. Don't pay attention to her. She's a crazy woman. Yulia, how did your father in law die? He was found dead by the lake, lying there holding his heart. Acute heart attack. Near the lake is where Sasha drowned? Yes. I see. You know, I'm glad that Andre decided to continue his father's business. Sasha dreamed of seeing the farm prosper. Olga, Andre is selling the farm. He's selling it. When? Today, right after you sign the documents. Who? To Sergei Kabilov. He's the owner of the agro farm. He's in charge of fodder. All the fields around are his. 
By the way, he's your neighbor. Neighbor. Here you go. Thank you. You're welcome. So have you signed it yet? No, we're waiting for a call. We should celebrate. Isn't the manager gonna kick us in the nuts for drinking this morning? We are not so much and who wants to lose his job? Is he not a human being? And there won't even be any layoffs. You're already here. Good morning to you two. Olga Nikolaevna. If it's good. Please. First, we'll sign the deed of transfer. Then we'll move on to the sale document. Please. Sign next to your surname. Olga, is something wrong? Why didn't you tell me you were selling the farm? What does it matter? To him? To me? Yes. Sasha wanted the farm to stay in the family. But Sasha's gone. But I am. And I won't sign. What do you mean? I'm taking over the inheritance, and as co-owner I refuse to sell the farm. Are you crazy? <clears throat> Olga Nikolaevna, you probably don't know. The thing is that your farm is bankrupt and it won't survive the year. I'm giving good money for it. I've said everything. You've decided to play hostess. Go ahead, but don't count on my help. Don't you want half the farm? I don't work with psychopaths. Yes, I'm listening. I got it. I'll tell you. What do you want to say? Don't keep me in suspense. No. We have a new owner. Olga Nikolaevna Chorus. Yes, she'll take over now. I'll have to look for a new job. Why can't she sit abroad? That's enough. It's not good news. But we have the power to fix it. And how are you gonna fix it? You gonna marry her and then sign over the farm to yourself? You're a stupid woman, Sinka. I'll be smarter than you. If you're so smart, then come on. Have you got any ideas? I have some. Fedorovic, if you have something to say, say it. We need to arrange such a paradise life for this foreign madam that she sells her share to Kapila. Did you come up with it yourself? What do I have to offer? Everything is not the way Petya lives with you. Don't touch my Petya, or you'll work for dentists all your life. Oh, that's it. Go ahead. What can I think about it? We have no choice. Either the farm stays with this one. Or as Fedorovic says, Who's in favor? I'm in favor. I'm in favor. Let's drink to that. What do you mean we're staying? Where are we staying? In this hole with the roosters. Nikita. Nikita what? I've been Nikita for 14 years. I've got 50,000 subscribers on YouTube. What do I show them now? Nakira, I realize this is all very sudden for you. Unexpected. Unexpected is if you suddenly changed your color to green, I would be very surprised. But to stay, I do not agree. But Dad wanted... Mom, are you listening to yourself? Dad had plans. He wanted a small farm and he would have done it. What are you going to do with the cows? Teach them the triple tulip. You're wrong. I am right. And you know it. Mom. What's gotten into you? You didn't want to do this, did you? Son. It just seems to me that there's something wrong here. The dad didn't die by accident, you know, and I want to get to the bottom of it. 
You're playing detective, too. Nakira. I see everything. What Sasha did. How am I supposed to deal with all this? And I thought you'd be there for me. I'll support you. Yes? Excuse me, did you order? Yeah, leave it as it is. Anything else? No, thank you. The called party's phone is switched off or out of range. I'm asking why you still haven't paid for the seed. Do you want to ruin my sewing season? So the accounting department. What accounting? Don't you know where the accounting department is or should I go there for you? Sergei Vladimirovich, am I interrupting? And you're free in that tomorrow all the documents will be on my desk. Sure. Hello? Are you mad? You ruined my mood this morning. That's what I'm talking about. What are we doing with the new land? Let's go back. Where did this contagion come from? Listen, maybe we shouldn't hurry. Women are unpredictable. What if she changes her mind, eh? I'll wait till Monday. If nothing changes, I'll go to the village council to talk to Ivanovich again. You should know how hard it cost me to get this land, bitch. She lives next door. She's encroaching from all sides. Don't yell. Have you seen her? She's small, skinny. She can't have a farm. She'll run away in a month at the most. Something tells me otherwise. Thank God she's alive, because I had already changed my mind while I was running. Why did you disconnect the phone? I don't want to talk. To who? No one. What about the farm? Don't act like you don't know. You got what you wanted, that's it. Nobody's selling anything and nobody's going anywhere, be happy. Don't yell. You'll thank me later. The lumberjack is here. He's waiting. Give me a break with your prophecies. You're shouting and shouting. Have you had enough? I baked your favorite pie. Do you want some? I don't want it. Where are you going? For a walk. Be careful. Mom, don't stop. I need to find something to stream about. Or I won't have a single subscriber in a week thanks to you. Oh hi, and yo. Can you tell me what you have interesting in the village? A farm. I see. Julia, come in. I'm in the kitchen. What's wrong with him? Rebellion. He didn't understand my decision to stay. To be honest, I didn't understand either. Is Andre mad? I don't know. I haven't seen him. And I don't want to call him. Let him calm down a bit. Why did you change your mind? I thought it would be a betrayal. And I can't betray Sasha. And Kopolov is a nasty guy. Everything that is not done is for the best. Come on, don't worry. I'm even kind of glad that you didn't sign. So much work and give up everything. 
Thank you. I thought everyone would curse me. Not me. Hello, friends. It's me again, Nikitis, and this is a new blog. Behind my back is the Vagila school where I'm going to study. Hi, are you new? Yes, listen, I've already screwed up five takes. You can get out of the frame. I'm sorry. What are you shooting? It's a video for the blog. What's anyone interested in that? Do you guys have anything more interesting? If you're not afraid, you can go to the capist. Where, where, to the capist? Yes. Let's get out of here quickly. Why? So don't say anything and don't do anything, got it? There's another bastard here. What are you doing here? Fuck off, let's go. Hey, what do you want? Why are you so cocky? Listen, we have to teach him a lesson. Run. Come on. Come on, hurry up. This way. Come here. Quickly. Come on. Come on. What are they doing? The locals at the Capisht don't want them. They're afraid. I see. Yulia, can I ask you a question? Of course. Sasha lived here for a year. And it turns out I don't know anything about the house. What exactly do you want to know? Tell me, has he been seen with anyone? What do you mean? With another woman. I'll tell you this, rumors spread quickly here, but I can't say anything about Sasha. Although... What? Toja, there's one here who's been chasing him. Toja? Aha, granddaughter of Grandma Gunna. She works in the village council as a secretary. So between us, she's after all the men. So you'll show me everything on the farm? Of course. So what do they want from you? Nothing, they're just assholes. So why don't you tell your parents? So daddy can kill them and go to jail. They pick on everyone, it's easier to ignore them. That's crazy. Say, that's cool. Yeah. Look, what are the locals afraid of? According to legend, the place is considered cursed. Like whoever comes here will die soon. That's crazy. Well, it's very convenient nonsense. You can hide from me and his scumbags. My battery's dead. I'll take it off tomorrow. Shall we go back? I'll just get everything together. Whoa, what's that? It's my father's bracelet. What was he doing here? What's the legend about? <laughs> oh, mum, it's like this. In short, once I you a waterman and a woodsman who of them will carry the stone father. The woodsman was cooler and the waterman brought out of the ground spring. 
which spilled into the lake. The woodsman was walking trip to drop the stone into the lake and drowned, where the stone is now a capish, a cursed place, and who will disturb the keys. He kind of soon die. And what keys? It's where the woodsman hangs out. And what do the locals believe in that? Fortunately, yes. It's wild. And that grandma was talking about the woodsman. Mom. Mom, do you think that? What? That dad was killed. I don't know. Son, but I'd really like to find out. Mom, I've been thinking. Don't worry about me. We have to stay. So we have to stay. Thank you. I don't want to, guys. Let me go. I'd like to familiarize myself with the investigation materials. What else is not clear to you? The expert examination confirmed that it was an accident. What did the autopsy show? That in the cold water there was a bath constriction and that's it, an accident. That's why we closed the case for lack of corpus delicti. But Sasha had a healthy heart. Citizen, what do you want from me? There are the results of the examination. You tell me he was healthy. And I'll tell you that you just didn't know everything about your husband. I ask you to think about it and when I come back we'll have a serious talk about everything. Sasha. It's out of the question. I'm not going anywhere. I understand that you feel obliged. Your father helped us a lot. But he's gone and you're not obliged to continue the family business. And I'm not obliged to. Are you waiting for me? To you, if you're a notary. A specialist in prenuptial agreements. Single, by the way. I'm here for the Forest Farms case. Forest? Remember you did the deed? I don't remember, and I'm on vacation. But I wanted to ask you about some details. Look, I don't want any trouble. I'm just a notary, and you can solve your own problem. What are you talking about? It looks like someone doesn't want the deal to go through. Who doesn't? How do I know who? I don't want it now either. I mean, I don't care without me. You didn't close the door. What are we waiting for? The bosses are new. Let's have a look at this foreign madam. Oh, they come. Good morning. Good morning. I think you all know, I'm the wife. I mean the widow of Alexander Igorovic, and now I'll be in charge of the farm instead of him. So if you have any questions. Yes. Do you know what a forage cow is? What kind of fodder and when to give it? How calving goes, and in general, what to do with all this? Here we go. Why are you doing this? Don't shut my mouth. You've got your tongue in one place. Or maybe someone thinks wrong. Now she will command here, destroy everything that's left and fly away from where she came from. And what are we to do with all this? There's no work. You, Sinad, don't work too hard. Why should I overwork for free? We have two months instead of wages, only advances. And I'm sorry, nobody gives me debt in stores and gas is not free either. And what about salaries? I don't know. Zinoviyevic does all the accounting. Andrei supervises. I'll try to understand everything and I'll let you know the result. You better give me the wages. Let's go.
What? Start with accounting. I don't know anything about it. I'm an accountant by training. I can help you. Where's the chief? He went to the housing department. What do you want? Why didn't you come? I was waiting for you. And why did you come? I cannot without you. I've heard it a hundred times. What's next? We'll hide in corners, run to hotels in the district center. Andre, I'm fed up. I've been waiting. I've been honestly waiting for you to sell this farm. We'll be together. We'll have money and we'll finally leave this hole to start a new life. Well, Toja, so... You promised me. What do you want from me? I don't want to sell this farm. You know everything. I know, but I can't go on like this. Either you get a divorce or go home to your wife. Toja, I love you very much. What are you doing? Are you crazy? Get up. No, I won't get up. Andre, please get up. No. Okay, let's have lunch at our place. Promise? Yes, I promise. Please get up. Morning. Morning. Are you here to see me? Yes, I'm here for the receipts. I see here, print out the schedule of fares. The district center called. We participate in receipts for Andre Gorovic. Right away. Yes. I'll be waiting. Yes. I'm writing. Give it to me. Listen, you don't seem to understand. We'll write you a lot of prescriptions after school. Where? At the Capish. Oh, I forgot. You're so fearless you don't go there. You're kind of brave, aren't you? A little bit. Why? Guys, come here, come here, come here. Don't be afraid. We have here a man who thinks that he is not afraid of anything. Personally, I think that he is a complete blabberman. But he has the opportunity to prove otherwise. How about this idea? You go to the Kluchi, sit there until 12 at night and shoot everything that happens on video. Well, and then show us. I'm in when? Any day till the weekend. Friday after school and till night. Okay, but if you don't sit, you can go straight to your house. Calm down. It was stupid. He caught you and set you up. He thinks he did, but I'm not from around here. What are you gonna do, go to the Kluchi? Well, I'm going. What's the big deal? It's a bad idea. Even adults don't go there at night. Well. I have no choice now. Hey, are you busy? That depends. We need to discuss the financial situation of the farm. Well, that's not for me, that's for the accounting department. But you're the owner. So are you, you wanted to do it. Anatoly Zinovivik is in his office. Is that the accountant? Yes. Andrei Yegrovic. The pump broke down again. We have to do something with the cattlemen. From today on all questions to the new mistress. She doesn't know anything. I don't care what's going on with the cattlemen, cows, pumps and everything else. They forgot about me. They forgot. All right. And print out the quarterly report for me, please. Why don't you pay wages? The price of fodder went up, so I had to cut back. Have you tried distributing the money at the expense not of the employees? 
I'm not the one who makes decisions. I cut what they told me to cut, so I cut it. I understand that this obscene amount of money for fodder. Yes, it is for hay. There is also for silage. The rest is all my own. Why is the hay and silage someone else's? All the fields are leased from Kapilov. We have nowhere to sow. And we have nothing of our own? Well, conditionally, of course we do. What do you mean, conditionally? All our poyas are on the keys, but no one from the locals will go there. Wait a minute. You mean we got land where we could grow hay, but we don't because it's supposedly cursed? Yeah, well, you know, it's people. They're afraid. You gotta be kidding me. Okay, what other options are there besides the klutchy? Agree with Kapilov. That's out of the question. What else? Well, go to the head. Maybe he has some reserves, but it's unlikely, believe me. What's the head's name? Ivan Ivanovich. Good afternoon. Is Ivan Ivanovich in? Yes, but he's going to the neighborhood now and I'm going to lunch. So if you have something urgent, give me a quickie. Yes, I mean, no, we have to discuss it. Tell me what kind of perfume you have, such a familiar scent. It's a vintage, a perfume from the year 1932nd. That's right. I forgot the name. Excuse me. Will you write to me? I want to make a gift to my friend. She loves this brand. Yes, of course. Thank you. How much do they cost? At least approximately? They're expensive. My man gave them to me. Here you go. It's good when men are able to give such gifts. Good afternoon. Not interrupting. What did you want, Sergei? Is Ivanovich in? He's going to the region. Come back tomorrow. Tosenka, it's very urgent. Is it okay that I came first? Young lady, what is your business? None of your business. Oh, Ivanovich. Hello? Sergei, yes, said you want to return the poi. Yes. Let's discuss it tomorrow. You and your lawyer will come, so there won't be any problems. Did you want something? Hello, my name is Olga Forrest. I wanted to talk to you about renting feed. And you rent or take? To take. That's great. Just discuss it with Sergei Vladimirovic. He's just handing it over and he'll come to me tomorrow with the lawyers. Sorry, guys. I'm in a hurry. Bye. Please. So, what's going on with the feed? Are you turning them in? I want it too. Well, then we can team up tomorrow and do a direct feed transfer. No. Why not? I changed my mind. You... You know who? That's a shame, isn't it? And you think only you can change your mind at the last moment? I'll sow the fields anyway. What will you sow? Five acres in the garden. The Kluchi. Clutch, really. Good luck. We'll see who's who. Toja. Andre. What's wrong again? Everything's wrong. You wanted to talk, talk. We have to wait a bit longer. Olga will run away. Yes, she won't give her part of the share now, but half is enough for us. That's exactly enough. Enough. Listen and wait. You convinced me that everything would be all right, and what? Did you really expect her to just take and give you her money? She offered it to me. It doesn't matter. I don't need that money. I need you, and that's all. 
What are you offering me? Are you suggesting that I proudly walk away naked and barefoot, leave everything to Yilka and Sasha's wife? Why should I be the one to do it? It's my father's farm. They're the ones who have nothing to do with it. I'm pregnant. It's my 12th week. I have to register, so I'm sorry. You either decide now or I'm leaving, pack up and leave. Where to? Anywhere. I don't want my kid to be told his mom's a bitch or a whore. I'm not gonna let anyone say that, you know. I love you. We're going to have a baby. There's a lake on a hill, and beyond the lake, a forest and fields, that's the Zivi Kluchi. It's strange the Kluchi are called living, but people die, where's the logic in that? I don't know. Maybe there used to be water there and then swamp. And now it's a swamp too. Where the Kluchi are, yeah, I'll go with you, if you need someone to pull someone out. Really? Maybe you don't have to. You didn't sign up for this. You really have two options right now to stay alive. The first is to tell your mom and not go, but you'll get beaten up and bullied. Or the second is to use my help. I think it's stupid to change my mind. Yeah, you're right. Katya, wait. I know how to get rid of Olga. Only you have to help me with this. Okay. Oh, and you said none of the locals go there. We don't want them to see us. Why not? knows. She's a witch's granddaughter. She'll cast a spell. Do you really believe that? Quiet. It's Uncle Andre. I wonder what they were doing together. I don't like all this. Let's go. Hello? Have you seen the vet? Yulia? Yes. She went to the nursery. To the kids? To the calves. There's a separate building behind the couches, over there. Thank you. Yulia, hi. Hi, Olga. I've decided to sow Zivi Klauchi. At least we can take a loan from the bank against future profits. What do you think? To be honest, I don't think anyone will agree to work on the keys. Maybe it's better to talk to Kabalov. He's just doing it to spite you. No, he won't give the feed now. He'll kill himself, but he won't. I've spoiled everything for everyone. Do it if you want, but don't count on it too much. No, it's a matter of principle now. If necessary, I'll sit behind the tractor myself. Oh, my God. Well, my good ones, we'll do everything quickly. Oh, Andrei Igorovich, yes, I need your signature. That's for Olga Nikolaevna. She doesn't have a license, please. It's urgent. Where do I sign? Right here. Is that all? Yes, thank you. What's new? Olga Nikolaevna decided to sew Klaichi and make her own feet. Come on, really? She went home to print out the ad. Let her go. When everything starts, invite me. I want to see it. 
But people aren't happy. Should we talk her out of it? No, let her sew. The more she fails, the better. Maybe she'll realize she doesn't belong here. I'll take care of it. What are we gonna do? The same as always. Toja. Oh, Mum, what are you doing? Nothing, just ventilating. I'm going to tell you such a story. Come into the living room. I'll be right down. Yes, but hurry up. I'm really hungry. I'm coming. Where did you get such riches? Aunt Julia gave it to help the hungry. And how is your day at the new school? Everything is fine. How are things on the farm? Not good. By the way, will you help me put up the posters? Sure. The food here is great. What was it you wanted to tell me? Well, I could be wrong, I could be wrong. But Uncle Andre is cheating on Aunt Yulia. How do you know that? I saw her with some girlfriend in the woods. In the woods. Mom, not in terms of seeing them, you know. I got it. The two of them came out of the woods from the Kapista side. What did she look like? Pretty. Redhead. Eyes like this. The village sex bomb. I see. Nakita, don't tell anyone about this. Do you understand? Who would I tell? I don't know anyone. So what are those ads? How much money is she paying for those? For a month, probably. Are you seriously going to work for the Klatchi? For that kind of money, I'd work for the devil. Leva, call me and find out what's going on and when to come out. Zinovievic, is it true? Hello. Yes, we need it. And you don't mind that it's the clutchy. Great. Thank you very much. Go straight there. Goodbye. Yes. Hi. Hi, Velik. Smells good. You want breakfast? No, thanks. Is something wrong? Something's up. Don't tell me, we missed the tender. No, it's worse than that, my friend moved, and I missed it. I was at the head of the department. He said you don't give up the fodder. Sergei, is there anything you want to tell me? Nope. So you're nope, it has nothing to do with the new owner of the farm. 
who, by the way, wanted to take over the feed. I don't have to give her anything, okay? Did you see the way she looked at me? How? Like she wasted the best part of her life on me and I'm going to lose money, but I'm not going to help her. Here we go. Your crush into her. I don't have a crush on anyone, she's petty. Yes, you are. I don't have a crush. So who's into who? No one's got a crush. Come on, sit down, eat and go to school. What's wrong with him? Eat and go to school. I'm going to work. It's kind of creepy. Stay there. I'll make more money run. What? Run, I said. All left and ran, and the tractor driver ran to the church out of harm's way. You see, he doesn't care what they promised you. What are you talking about now? The whole village already knows. The woodsman showed up at the Kluchi. The men saw him. They were so mad they threw all their equipment away. The devil brought her here. She thought of plowing the kluchi. Now we'll be in trouble for sure. Sorry. I won't plow the kluchi. Here's your advance payment. Sorry. And now what? Listen, who do we buy fodder from? From Kapilov. Everybody buys it from him. There is no one else. So it's a monopoly. Well, we'll shake up this monopoly a little. Mom says something might happen today. What could happen here? Somebody's gonna die, that's all. Why are you so scared? He's the one who should be scared, not you. Look. I'll check about tomorrow. Nothing's cancelled, right? No, it's still on. You don't have to come. Be a sucker is painful but not deadly. You know about it, right? What are you doing? Make up. Quiet, guys. Let's go. We'll wait for the video report. We will. Blogger blogging, making stupid videos. I'm scared. I don't believe in all this stuff. Yes. What brings you to me? Will you ask for a drink again after the fiasco with the Kluchi? No, my farm wants to terminate my contract with your holding company. Are you going to feed the cows with solar power? Very funny. Seriously, you want to hurt me? Before I bought your farm, I went through all the paperwork. You're bankrupt. You can't buy fodder in another region. It would be suicide. Do you take me for an idiot? 
I called several agricultural holdings. Even with delivery, they will cost me twice cheaper than yours. Working with competitors. And it's not about competitors. It's in my opinion someone is stingy. I'm stingy? I sell you feed at the biggest discount, plus free shipping. That's what you call the biggest discount. What do you say? I say somebody's stealing from you, and they're stealing big. What do you mean? Here are my invoices for the same goods. Look. It's three times cheaper. And here it's even four times cheaper, look. And who can steal from their own? There's nothing to think about, either the one who signs, or the one who manages the finances, or both. Tell me, can I print out these invoices? Yeah, yeah, sure, just a second. Hello, yes, Ludmila Vasilevna. How was she not in English? You mean with the boy? Who, Nikita, is he new? Yes, okay, I'll be right there, goodbye. What happened? My daughter wasn't in class. She went for a walk with some Nikita. Is your daughter's name Katya? Yes. But from where your son is Nikita, I see. Let's go to school. Yes, it's faster on mine. Hello, friends. It's me again, Nikitis, and today I'll be checking the paranormal phenomena, which locals call the woodsman. He lives in the woods behind our back where now we cut here and we'll go. Let's go, Hugh, let's go. Come on, carefully. I know no more than you do. The kids say that Katya left after school right away with Nakita. What kids? Where did she go? They went to the river. Boy, please tell me what happened. Kalia. This newcomer bet with Makar that he would stay at the Kluche until 12 at night and shoot everything on video. And Katya went with him for company. Thank you. Goodbye. I wonder if it's true. What do you mean? Well, this legend of yours, like whoever visits here will die, my father was here and died. You know, when my mom died. I'm sorry. It was a long time ago. I was just in high school. Did she drown too? No, she was an agronomist. A field was on fire. And they took water from the lake, pulled hoses, then it rained. And my mom inhaled the smoke, got caught in the downpour, double inflammation. Complications, and that was it. Grandmothers at the cemetery whispered that they saw her at the Kapish, that it was her woodsman avenged for his water. And who do you live with, with grandmother? Why, grandma, with my father, he didn't give me to anyone. He raised me himself. He's so cool. Yeah, mine was tough too. It's getting dark. Yeah. And there seems to be no connection. Yes, wait a second. Friends, it's already gone the third hour, and it's all the same quiet and tedious. There are no forests, witches, ghouls and other evil. It's boring. Who's that? Where? It's probably a boar. No, it's a woodsman. I can't go any farther. I'll call the Ministry of Emergency Situations. And you keep dialing.
In case there's a connection. Wow, it's a bomb. I'll blow up you two. We gotta get out of here first. Yeah. I think we came from over there. Or here. Don't panic, I've just got the last stick left. I'll try to GPS it. Yeah. We just need to climb a tree. Hold the backpack, please. Put the cube in the inside pocket. Okay. I'm on it. Oh, that's great. Got it. What? On the net. Call him. Hello, Mom? Nakira, where are you? Mom, I'm in a tree. We got lost. There's a lake on the left and on the right. Nakira. What happened? Disconnected. He says he's in a tree and on the left he sees a lake. On the left means they're not far from Prosika. Katya. Nakira, are you alive? Yes, but my leg hurts a lot. Help us. Katya. Dad, we're here. Are you okay? Son, is everything all right? Nakita seems to have broken his leg. Where does it hurt? Down near the foot. Let me see. Be careful. Calm down. We have to go to the hospital. Dad, we didn't mean it. We'll talk at home. Here, take it. Careful. Stand up. Go. Did you think it over? Get off. You can't build happiness on someone else's misfortune. Bad cards fall. So be it. Cards don't lie. So be it. You'll be lost with him. And you'll ruin me. I think we got it. So put it away, give it to me. It's good that it's only a sprain. You'll be running in a week. Mom, turn on the WIFE. Nakira. So I ran to Kotya. She's there alone. I'll see you out. Feel better, kid. Thank you. You apologize for what I told you. It's all nerves. Forget it. I'm sorry about the folder. If you haven't changed your mind, take it back and the folder is of course also in debt. The main thing for you is to sort out your accounting. Yes, of course. Good night. See you tomorrow. Oh, sorry. Andrew, what are you doing here? I need to check the pump, Vidya complained. You forgot that today is our anniversary. So?
Sorry, I've been working too hard and without a present. Well, it doesn't matter. The main thing is that we are together. I love you. You love me. And children, children will be, right? Let's go home. I've marinated the meat, bought wine. Okay, go home, put the meat on, half an hour, and I'll be there. I'll be waiting. Raven King, this is your town, brown-eyed and thin, you'll forgive everyone in private. Raven King, this is your town, you used to have a heart, but not anymore. It won't be long before the dawn approaches. Hello. What about the cows? I'll be right there. What could it be? I have no idea. We check for all diseases every month as standard. The cows are vaccinated, but here not just one cow died, but all of them at once. Could they have been poisoned? They could, but then it's because of feed or water. It's not because of water. We got a new pump yesterday, and the express water test showed nothing. But a new new batch of fodder was brought yesterday, so it should be checked. The fodder means... And when will the results on the fodder be ready? I'll personally take it to you. It would be faster. You can't give milk. You have to warn the dairy. Where to? When the results of the analysis will come, we'll understand there. Don't worry, we'll do everything. Tell me, were you in the office today? Did you see the accountant? No, I arrived earlier. He comes at 8. If you know anything, please let me know at once. Of course. You're working? We're pouring milk into the lagoons until the results of the tests. Greetings. Greetings to you, too. Why are you here early in the morning? I need a certificate of income. My son wants to take an apartment on credit, and I'll vouch for you. I found out about the cows, so I came straight to you before it all went to hell. What about the cows? 
What about cows? They've been at the farm since night. They say they poison the fodder. What will happen now? What will happen? Investigation will start. The landlady will run to Kapalov. Oh shit. I forgot. I forgot the keys to the safe at home. I'll be right back. Where's the certificate? And the certificate later, everything later. What are you doing here? I came to see Zanaviovic, and he turned around and left. Where to? Who knows? He's strange today. He's scared. I told him about the cows. He even shook. Shaken. You say... He won't answer the phone. Nothing. He won't run away. What's wrong? I can't watch this. I want to go to the smoke break. Yulia, what smoke break? Don't. We're all pissed off as it is. Our bosses are worried. What happened again? You were brought here by an unholy farce. That's what happened. Stop being rude. Or what? You'll fire me for telling the truth? What truth? We were living normally, working, until your family came to the Kluchi. What does that have to do with the Kluchi? Tell me more about the Wits Man. I'll tell you, you were warned not to touch it, but it itches in one place. She wants her own fodder. If she wants it, she gets it. So it's my fault they poisoned the cows? And who? Well, tell me why you came here. You could have stayed abroad. It would have been good for everyone. Exhaustive argumentation. You're smart, huh? Well, go milk it yourself and dump it in the manure and I've had enough. Olga. Where's Andre? Andre is at home. He said he wasn't feeling well. He's going to feel even worse now. What are we doing? I'll go get the men back, and you go to town with the tests. You're my clever girl. Everything is going smoothly. There's a lot going on at the farm. I don't know. I'm scared if everyone finds out it's me. They'll think it's Olka. They'll give her a boycott. So she'll go back to Warsaw. She won't fight. She's a star figure skater. She's used to everyone looking into her mouth and giving her a standing ovation. And if she doesn't go? If she leaves, no one else will want to work with her. But it's even better for her. I don't know how we won't hurt ourselves. You've already lost a lot of money. And the cattle are a pity. The sleeping pills won't harm them, and by the time the test results come back, Olga will give up. He's so bad that you've already gone to your mistress in the morning. I read that only after the 16th week he starts to push, honestly. I think I can hear him. Well, maybe it's hers. Or maybe it's hers. Well...
Yes. Hi. Oh, hi. Come on in. I'll make it quick while I'm on break. How are you? I'm good. Imagine from the morning, already 50,000 views. Everybody's going crazy, saying we're cool. We're mega cool now, so what about Mika? Is he in trouble? No, he's giving us respect and appreciation. I didn't expect that from him. I didn't want to upset you, but they're already placing bets when we... Oh, don't worry. The woodsman isn't so scary if he's run away from us, everything will be fine. Okay, I'm off. Bye. Hi. Hi. How's Katya? She got it yesterday. Young naturalist. I see, did you hear? What? An emergency at the farm. What emergency? Someone poisoned the animals and the workers boycotted Olga. I don't understand. Who poisoned the animals? Fuck knows. Call her. Yes, Sergei? Olga, what happened there? I can't talk. I'm driving. Where are you? I'll come over. I'm on my way home to check on Nakira, then back to the farm. Wait for me at home. I'll be there in 10 minutes. Okay. Yeah. I'll call you later. You're here. So they're looking for me already, huh? Talia, why the hell did you run away? What am I supposed to do? Our feed prices are sky high. If Olga finds out, we're dead. So what if she finds out? Did you sign the papers? No. Did you choose the supplier? No. Blame it on Andre. So he'll say he doesn't know. So what will he say? What's your problem? I'm afraid... Someone finds out it's you. I mean us, well. Don't talk so much and everything will be fine. I can't. I'm afraid that I'll give everyone away. I can't lie. If they start picking on me, that's it. Do you want to go to jail? I don't want to. It's in your best interest to sit here and sniffle, okay? There's no proof that you're the one who rigged the money. You start shooting up, you're dead. What about you? I have nothing to do with it. If you ever mention me to me, you won't live to go to jail, understand? Got it, got it. It's okay. We'll see who has nothing to do with it. You guys up to something again? Mom, a hundred thousand hits. But the comments don't believe the Woodsman is real. What? It doesn't matter. No, son, talk. I'm listening to you. Well, they say it's a setup, but the main thing is the effect. Exactly the effect. It's a setup. What's wrong with her? I don't know. It's you, isn't it? It's me, I'm what? Did you invent this circus with the woodsman? What circus? Why, it's a great plan. Hire an entertainer to run around the woods, scare the locals, sell us the spoiled fodder, and then buy our farm for nothing. There you go again. I don't want that. Who does? That's a good question. Well, I suggest we sit down somewhere and discuss this quietly. Maybe we can work together to find out who benefits from this, but not me. Let's go.
I couldn't find Zinovievich. The girls printed out the certificate, and now I need a signature from my boss. So go. There's no one. I've been waiting for an hour. Isn't that Andrei's jacket his? Andrei Igorovic. He didn't hear you. He's been acting strange lately. What a mystery. There's only one woman who'll blow your brains out, and with two women, it's a mess. So what makes you think I had anything to do with this hoax? Because it's obvious you're a long-time supplier to the farm. Right. Making a nice profit. Right. And then suddenly my father-in-law decides to cancel your services and plant the Zivi Kluchi. And that's when the woodsman shows up and starts freaking everyone out. Don't you think this coincidence is strange? What logic? You will accuse me of the death of my father-in-law and husband in order to sell you feed. It never occurred to me. But now it has. Look, calm down, I didn't kill anyone. If you're so principled, let's cancel the contract and buy fodder from whoever you want. But keep in mind that I have nothing to do with deaths, nor with the woodsman, nor with the deaths of cattle on the farm. All right, who does? How do I know? I don't believe in curses or witches. I just have facts, two strange deaths, and a strange man running around the fields. In the end, I just want to know what's going on here. Is that why you decided not to sell the farm? Because of your husband? Are we already on a first-name basis? I'm sorry. It's okay. It's easier that way, yes. I think my husband was murdered and it has something to do with the Kletchi. That's what I told the police investigator. Let them look for it. Come on, let's look at the situation from a different angle. Not only it was profitable for me to sell you Fota, but it was also profitable for someone else to buy it from you and for the same reason not to plant their fields. You know? By the way, have you sorted out those wild figures in the payments? No, the accountant disappeared and Andre. Andre was busy. I'll talk to him later. Sorry. Hello? I'll be right there. What happened? The accountant was killed. Where is he? You can't come in here. I'm the owner of the farm. I have some information for you. Wait. Stop. At least now we know that all deaths are not accidental. What happened? Olga Kforis provided us with documents showing that you and the murdered man, Beriak, who was the chief accountant of the farm, were stealing large sums of money from the company. I didn't know anything about it. Your signature is all over it. Listen, I don't care much about the farm's affairs. Yes, I was given some documents, I signed them, but I don't know what was in them. Employees claim they saw you near the hangar at the time of your death. That's not true, I wasn't there. Where were you between 11 and half past 11? Well, I was at home. Who can confirm that? No one, I was alone, I was asleep. I see, in that case, I'll have to detain you on suspicion of murder until the circumstances are clarified. But I didn't kill anyone. That's what they all say, read this, write it down from my words, it's written down correctly and sign it. Do you think Andre could have do this?
How are the cows? Cows are live. Cows are live. What about the tests? Opiates were detected in the tests. Someone spiked the animals and there was a narcotic effect. That's why they couldn't get up. But as soon as the effect passes, everything will be normal. And what's going on? Anatoly was killed. Andrei's in jail. Murdered how? What does Andrei have to do with it? He couldn't. He could poison cows, but he couldn't kill them. How can you do that? Please, let's calm down. Calm down. Like Sinoviavik for eternity? Where did Andrei get the drugs? Why would he poison cows on his own farm? Maybe he doesn't need to, but his mistress, the witch, she went to the field, picked it up and slipped it in. You are lying. I think you're the only one who doesn't know they're meeting under your nose. Did you know? Olga. Yes, Yulia, I saw them together. Together? He got her pregnant. Yulia? Look at Tosia. She's running to Tosca. She's going to tear her hair out. Hi. Hi. What do you want? Oh. Oh. I have a sting in my side. Old age is no fun. There she is, do you see? What is she doing? She's going to drown herself. Stop! No. Stop! Yulia. Stop! Let go. Let me go. I've made up my mind. Let me go. Let me go. It's me. It's all my fault. It's me. It's not your fault. I couldn't give birth to a child. Calm down. It's not your fault. It's me. Quiet, quiet. Let's go home now. I'll go get the car closer. All right, all right, calm down. Yulia, do you remember you told me that Tosia and Sasha have fallen in love together? Yes. Now let's go to my house. I'll show you something I'm interested in your opinion. Do you hear me? Okay. Let's go home. What are you looking at? Pack up. We're leaving. Are you out of your mind? Where are you going in your old age? Running away at your mercy. I told you to stay out of it. Don't cling to a married man. What's that got to do with it? You think I don't know you poisoned the cows? Everyone knows about it. And about your boyfriend's baby, too. And her? Can't you hear me? I'm telling you everything. What about Andre? They arrested your Andre. They say he killed an accountant.
How did they arrest him? When? What murder? Wake up, girl, don't you realize? You're a witch to them. They'll accuse you of everything. That he stole money for you. That he killed the accountant as a witness and that he poisoned the cows with your help. Do you want to give birth to a child in prison? When was the accountant killed? At lunchtime. Andre couldn't have done it. He was with me. Where they took him. We have to go there now. That's right. Get ready. We'll go to the district. You'll see Andre there. You'll write a statement, but make it quick. You don't know everything yet, and I can't tell you everything. It's good that Andre is in jail now. Death is walking near, waiting for him. Believe me. Have you opened the baiting season? Sort of. And where are you going again? We're going to our place. It's boring here, and I've got candy and a console. Great. Bring me some dry clothes. Okay. We should have taken the evening bus. We'll freeze till someone stops. We can't wait. We can't. Grandma, maybe you're making it up. What will they do to us? They won't throw stones at us. You not understand a lot. You're still young. I just want to pee. I'm pregnant. It's cold. I can't stand it. So go. Just go quickly. Wait. I'll be right back. If you see a car, pull over. Grandma. 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 What are you doing, Grandma? What is it, Grandma? What is it? Help me. Oh my God, help me, help me, somebody please. So these are the findings and the situation today. That's definitely her perfume. Listen, do you really think that Andre and this one are involved in Sasha's death? I want to show it all and tell the police. Tell them what about the forest or that someone was walking in the woods and dropped a bracelet? And the spirits, what do they talk about? Nothing. Maybe Sasha liked their smell. He wanted to give you the same one. Wait, I remember. In general, the day Sasha died, Andre was in a terrible mood. He argued with everyone. Then in the evening, he went somewhere and did not answer the phone. Gone. And where did he go? You don't know. I don't know. He came in very late. He was so worked up and his jacket button was pulled out from the root. I asked him where it was caught. He got angry and didn't say anything. Oh my God. I'm married to a monster. He killed my brother because of his mistress and the accountant because of money. Stop jumping to conclusions. And the main thing is not clear why Andrew could kill Sasha. What motive, jealousy, money, and in general? Nothing in this story does not add up. It's been such a hard day. My head hurts. I'm going home. You can stay at my place if you want. Don't worry, I won't do anything to myself. I really felt everything. I just didn't want to believe it. Yo, are you sure? Don't worry, everything will be fine. I'll take some analgin and go to bed. No one cancelled work tomorrow. Is she alive? 
Yes, but you understand, multiple fractures, pain shock, condition is serious, and age. We can only wait. Yes, I understand. If she wakes up. We'll call you back, leave the number with the nurse on duty. Okay, but my phone is broken. I'll leave my husband's number. Yes, of course. Thank you very much. Excuse me, you need to testify. Yeah, okay. Let's go. Can I ask you a question? Oh, uh, sure. Tell me, my husband was arrested today. Can you take him to the station? I need to write a statement. Okay, but first describe the car that hit your relative. Okay. Take him away. Yes, I lied. I have an alibi. At the time of the murder, I wasn't at home. I was with my mistress. She can confirm it. Why didn't you say so before? If my wife found out, I'd be dead. Bring his cell phone. No need. I remember the number. Call your mistress, tell her to come, write a statement, we'll deal with it. Aha. Uh -huh. The called subscriber's phone is switched off or is not in the network area. Please leave a message. Phone's disconnected. You want to confuse the investigation. Can you bring my phone? I'll ask my friend to come to her house and find out everything. Okay. While you write down where you were, what you were doing at the time of the accountant's murder. Okay. Maybe we shouldn't have let her go. I think it's better for her to be alone. It's crazy. What if Andre had a fight with Sasha like he did with me about the farm? Well, let's say he did. Then what? Andre drags Sasha into the lake and drowns her, right? There would be traces. There's no trace. No. Tosia could have given Sasha something to drink, like cows. Tosia is the killer. Do you believe what you're saying? And Andrewka doesn't look like a serial killer. We should talk to Andre, find out what happened that night. What was that note? That's a good idea. Andre. Andre, yes. Andre in the sense of missing. I got it. I'll check and call you back. Tosia is missing on the phone, does not answer, asks to go to her house. Yulia. My eyes are falling out. Yes, what are we going to do? I don't know. We've already played everything. I don't feel like watching movies. Hey, why don't we play dice? I've got a dice right here. What is it? You roll it and whoever gets the highest number wins. I'll just tear off the ring. To what? For gum. Okay. Listen, it looks like it's made of records. Do you have anything to pry it off? Yeah, now. I don't know. Think it's the password. I got to get to my mom.
No one's here. Where would they go on a night out? I don't know. They don't have any contact with anyone here. How much longer? Please, it's very important. Hello? Andrew, there's no one. Everything is closed. Serioga, listen to me carefully. Vo, I did not kill Talia. I was framed. Toshia is the only witness who knows that I was not at the farm at that time. If the killer knows about it, she is in danger. Please do something. You have to help her. Vo, find her, please. Andrew, I uh, will do everything we can. Don't worry. So what are your thoughts? Where to look for Grandma and Toshia? With thoughts, I don't know anyone here. Look, if Andre claims he was with Toshia all the time, then who did the men at the farm see in his jacket? Who? Well, maybe we should ask them. Let's go. Let's go. Mom! Mom! I'll call her now. She forgot her phone at home. Let me call my dad. Maybe they're together. No, let's try to find out what the password is for. Like in the game, but for real. Yes. Come on. I think it's the code to the treasure vault. I don't think my dad had treasure. But it's worth looking for. Can I come with you? Oh, sure. No, he didn't approach us. I recognized him from far away. By sight, from his jacket. He was wearing his jacket and passed by the hay briquettes where Zinovievic was found. In his work jacket, yes. And Andre's closet is here too. There it is. But it's closed. The case is clear. The case is dark. I've looked everywhere. There's nothing. Well, if you want to hide something without anyone finding it, you have to hide it in the most visible place. I bet the safe is behind her. <laughs> Elementary, Watson. Yeah, go ahead and dial. Seven, six, three, nine. You understand he's been arrested and it's not his fault. Let me through, please. Young lady. I've told you a hundred times, the working day is over, everybody's gone, leave the room. Can I at least just see him, please? What's going on here? A girl is trying to see her husband during non-working hours. To the husband? Yes, I mean no, he's not my husband. Well, he's my husband, but he's not mine. I'm here to see Andrake Forrest. He was arrested today on a murder charge, but he's not guilty, he was with me. Are you Antonina Kulesheva? Yes. And where have you been? We've been looking for you. Your phone is off. So he crashed. Here, here are the documents. Okay, let her through. Thank you. And the documents? It's a witness in the case. How did you open it? Dad left the code in the cube. So let's see. The documents for the house, for the car. Shall I take a look? Yes. Soil and water testing in the live keys area. I ordered the same one for the feed, right? So from some institute. The professor writes that the composition of the water is unique. 
You are the owners of the golden mineral bottom. Wait a minute. On some properties, water is not inferior. And on some parameters surpasses it. What does that mean? It means that someone knows the real value of the Zivi Kluchi and is trying to eliminate everyone who stands in the way of billions. Andre? If Andre knew the real value of the land, he wouldn't have sold it to me so cheaply. So there's the one who killed the accountant, and most likely Sasha. Don't forget your father-in-law. Okay, we have to go to Andres. You kids stay here. Although it's dangerous to leave them alone. Let Yulia take care of him. It'll keep an eye on everyone. Okay. You have Andrei Karost in custody. Can I see him? Just a moment. What are you doing here? Tosia has found. She has nothing to do with this. She's already suffered because of me. How? They tried to kill her. Grandma was run over. She's in the district intensive care unit right now. Guys, you're a lot of fun. Andre, do you still want to sell the farm? Actually, yes, but I'll have to give some of it away in the divorce, but that's okay. I see, so you don't know? Don't know what? We need to talk. Let's have a bite to eat. Shall we? That's how you and I are the owners of untold treasures. If we approach it that way. Why didn't Dad or Sasha tell me about this? I guess they just didn't have time. Andre, tell me about the day when Sasha died. Didn't you quarrel with him? What was it about? I wanted to sell the farm, but he was like you. He wouldn't let me. We agreed that we'd meet him and discuss everything normally. Well met at the Kapish. He had to show where he will plow the land. The conversation did not work out. We again quarreled and even each other's breasts dragged. And I took offense, spit returned home, and then you called me and I just like something felt, got ready. Dressed and quickly looked for him. And then you know. I came to the lake. Saw his jacket. And then I found him. What about you? What about me? Why did you make a date with my husband? What? I didn't set anything up. I found this in my husband's desk. She has nothing to do with it. I gave her perfume and hid the note at Sasha's, so that Yulia doesn't find out for us. Just say it like that, and there's no conspiracy theory. Yes. The number is hidden. Maybe from the hospital. I gave them your number. Hello? Yeah, yeah. Hello? Okay, we'll be right there. What about Grandma? She's awake and wants to see you. She knows the name of the killer. Let's go. Okay, Katya. Left foot on the red light. Got it. Nikita, right foot on green. I can't. 
Your parents are running late. They're deciding what to do with the billions. What billions? Money? We found documents that your Zivi Klutia are just a jackpot. I can see why the Woodsman is guarding it. I guard my gold too. Yikes. Oh. <coughs> Your parents are finally back. We'll check with them, Vic. Victor, what happened? Don't yell. Just quietly pack up and get in the car. You're driving, okay. Okay. The killer. Who? Victor. He killed Jaeger and the accountant. He killed me. I saw him. Where? In the woods by the lake. The car. The alarm. He killed everyone. That's it. Come out. Grandma, I'll come tomorrow. Well, who did it? Victor. Victor? I don't understand how he knew about the water, and more importantly, how could he have the land and the kluchi? I suggest you ask him that. They're still up. Doors open. Nikita. Nakita Kadia. Phones are all here. Maybe they ran to me or Yulia. Good evening. Good evening. If you're going to the farm, everything's fine there. No, we just lost the kids again. Victor and Julia went somewhere. I was just coming back from the farm and they were getting in the car. When was this? Where did they go? Towards the farm that way. Victor, let the kids go. Why, and leave you? And who's gonna give me what for you? Are you really serious about trading us for money? Not money, land. Kruchi, how do you know about that? None of your business. Now you go to Olya and tell her my terms. If by tomorrow afternoon they don't confirm that the deeds have been reissued, I'll shoot one of them, understand? You can't do that. I repeat, okay. Understood. Get out of here. You guys sit tight. I'm out of here. Not too much. It's fine for the right effect. Look, I'm depending on you now. I hope you can handle it. You bet I will. Let me untie your hands. Don't. Listen, I've been meaning to ask you something for a while. What? How did you get Sasha into the lake? I know whom and what buttons to push to get what I need. 
Sashes was guilt. What about me? I gotta go. No, they didn't come here. I'll ask Zinka at Zina. What? Have you seen Victor with the vet? No, but I saw his car. He was driving towards the woods. How long ago? Well, right after milking. That's about an hour and a half ago. Let's go. What? Listen, they're strange. She brought the evil power again. Here you go. Did you kill your grandfather for the land too? I didn't kill anyone. So he died on his own. Don't get smart. You're not gonna kill us, are you? Yeah, just like he's gonna kill Grandpa. I jumped on him by accident. I knew he had a weak heart. And the accountant. It's a stupid idea. Who would believe it? Are there others? Listen, let's not do it. Let's not do what? Well, all of it. Stealing? And what are you going to pay for your son at the institute with paper clips? Don't worry, we'll get through this. That's it for today. Everybody go to sleep. It's useless. How and where are we going to find them now? I'm calling the police. Call them. Look who's coming. Julia, what happened? Where are the kids? Victor. My God, what did he do to you? He threatened. He's got Nakita and Katya. Does he want money? No, he wants the Zivi Kluchi. Where is he? At the water tower. He's got a gun. He said he'd kill one of the kids if he didn't have an ID by lunch tomorrow. Bastard. He also warned no police. Do you know anybody, notary? Yes. I'm calling Andre. Sorry, he owns the farm, and without his signature, the documents are not valid. We knew Andre was with Tosia, and someone was wearing his jacket around the farm. Victor could have killed the accountant and framed Andre. Smart thinking comes later. Get in the car. What will be happens now? Nothing. I talked to Olga. She's agreed to buy half the farm from me. And the Kluchi. It's too early to tell, but Olga will probably tell Yulia. And there's no telling how much she'll ask for in the divorce. Can you imagine? And she wanted to drown herself because of us? That's her style. She tried to poison herself once, when Sasha left her at the institute. I rescued her then, I'm an idiot. OLYA is ringing, hello. Yes. Yes, okay, I'll be right there. What happened? Victor took the kids hostage. I'll come with you. No, Toja. Yulia's there and stay here. I'll call you back in the morning. Yes, but... Listen, the room is paid for a week. Wait for me here. 
I'll be back. Bye. Yes. The new notary will be in the office soon. He'll prepare the documents, and in the morning we can finalize the deal. Andrew didn't call. He'll be here soon. Good. Olga, I think we should go to the police after all. I don't want to discuss it again, and I don't want to risk my son. Do you think I want to risk Katya? Please don't. It's all about nerves. Hi. Hi. I don't want to see you, but we'll talk about that later. What can we do? There are data of the person on whom we should reissue the land before dinners. All documents with signatures and seals we should send to a certain address there will check everything, give a signal to Victor, and after that he promises to let the children go. And you believe him? Do I have a choice? Easy, easy. I'm sorry. God, why did I come here? Why did I get involved in all this? Hello? Okay, I got it. The notary is already there. Let me take the documents. I'm coming with you. No, no, you stay. You need to sleep. Rest. Tomorrow is a very hard day. I'll go with you. Olga, he's right. Just in case something needs to be clarified. Andrew will drive me right. Yes, I will take you. I'm waiting in the car. Everything will be fine. I'll close it. Sergei informed the police. It's better to be safe. What about Olga? She's a woman. She's emotional. I'll prepare her. Thank you. After the documents are sent, give me a signal. I will. We'll be waiting for you right here. Got it. And please don't do anything amateurish, okay? I got it. They're on their way to sign. I'll go. Yeah. Hi. You okay? I'm fine. It's birth control. The doctor prescribed it. Now I have to take it, even though it doesn't matter. Everything is important. You are young and beautiful. You have everything ahead of you. Of course. Everything's ready. They're waiting for us. Let's go. We'll be right there. Maybe you'll stay home. I'll get ready and come down. You know, I feel like an asshole. Andre, you're not the first or the last to leave your wife. I don't understand. What? How did Victor know about the clutchy? Maybe your father told him, decided to share the good news. I don't think so, so he didn't tell me, but he told the manager, right. Andre, what does it matter now? I want it to be over soon. Let's go. Great. Katye, Katye, he's gone somewhere, tried to untie my legs. It's cold, my hands are not obeying. Come on, I'm busy. Now you sign.
That's it. You can send it. Not quite. What's the problem? The police asked me to, that I'll only send photos of documents if I'm sure the children are alive. What? Olga, understand, I'm used to trusting professionals in all matters. Are you crazy? Enough. There's a man with no brakes and a gun in his hands, and you want to carry out the operation yourself. Got it. Great. What is it? Come on. Got it. Okay. What's next? What? What are you doing? Maybe we shouldn't? Quiet. Nakira. I shoot you. But you're worth a lot more than that. Quiet. Okay, but only if something happens to my son. I'll kill you. Or why, we've already discussed this, my daughter there too. I'm worried too. I'm sorry. Well, is there something else I don't know? We don't have time. Let's go to the village. They're waiting for us there. Does it hurt? It's fine. Sorry, sorry. Your parents are in no hurry to release you. Maybe we should hurry them up. They're on time, get up quickly, let's go. Let's go. Don't be stupid. Wait, wait. Where are the documents? Wait. I propose a trade. We'll give you the documents. You give us the kids. Do you take me for a fool? I clearly said to email me a photo of the documents. I got it. I understand sending. Sending now. One second. I'm sending it. Now we wait. Now everything will be checked and it's in your interest that everything was good there. Victor, listen. We all understand. In order to leave you need a hostage. Whatever kind, take me instead of the kids. We'll see. We'll wait and see. Come here. Let's go. You asked where your button was. You're an idiot. You okay? I'm fine. Thank you. I didn't expect it. You're welcome. I'm sorry. I'm sure you'll be happy. Of course I will. You have no idea how much. Are we moving again? It's Uncle Andre's stuff. Divorce and a nightstand between the beds? Just a divorce. I see. All right, stop. Help me out. As long as you see, take it to the pantry. 
Wow. Nakira, stop going through other people's stuff. I'm just gonna look at the pictures. <laughs> Have you seen Dad? What a lame outfit he's wearing. Then did everyone dress like that at that time? Oh, there's Aunt Julia. That's weird. What's weird? Aunt Julia's picture in his ex-husband's album. Actually, she's here with our dad. She didn't tell me that. Mysteries, secrets, investigations. What? Nothing, Mom. I'm going to cut ears. This and this are resting. Here we plan to throw in some lucerne and here some clover. Did you coordinate with the agronomist? Yes, these are his suggestions. Good. That's good what? Are you going to do anything? With what? With who? Rumor has it she's going back to Poland. What's that got to do with me? So you're just going to let her go? Sarosa, as a friend, I'm advising you to come out of your shell. Come in, I'm making coffee. Hi. Hi, my head hurts after the trial. How'd it go? It was uneventful, as if it wasn't even 16 years. What are you going to do now? I decided to change my life dramatically. Tomorrow I'm going abroad. I have enough money now. There are no deterrents. I am free and independent. Well, I'm glad you're in such a good mood. Yulia, can I ask you a question? When did you meet Sasha? You mean you're Sasha? Mm -hmm. I found some pictures and apparently he was yours before me. <laughs> it's my freshman year of college, Sasha, and I went to school together. I thought you knew. He didn't tell me anything. Olga, nothing happened between us. We went out together for nothing. All right. I'm sorry. It's okay. And I wanted to ask you. Will you take me to the airport? It's sad to leave alone. Sure, listen. I need to go to the farm to coordinate the documents in the legal department. I'm going to get ready for my new life. Good luck to you too. Hi. I was just about to call you. Olga, we need to talk. Is there something wrong with the paperwork? There's nothing wrong with the paperwork. Let's go. Is it something serious? Yes. I feel like getting some sweets and drinking tea. No, don't. You're scaring me. All the way after my wife died. I didn't think I'd feel feelings again. Sergey, I understand. I like you very much, really. But too little time has passed. I'm not ready yet. I don't know when I'll be ready. But not now. Please forgive me. It's you who forgave me. Hey, guys. Hi. It's good to have you here. I was wondering, do you need my signature or is there anything you need me to tell you? Because I'm just here to pick up Grandma Gunny's stuff and then back. She on the mend? Yeah. 
Strong old lady. She's gonna outlive us all now. Do you need me or not? Nothing. I'll call you later if you need anything. Yeah, hey. Have you been to see Yulia? How's she doing? She's in a good mood. That's good, because she's, you know, suicidal. When Sasha left her for you, she almost went crazy. I barely got her out of that state. It wasn't serious. What do you mean? She swallowed two cans of pills. And I spent six months calming her down, listening to her. That's honestly how we got back together. If we'd had kids, we'd have been fine. Unexpectedly, before this story with Victor, I thought differently about her too. Yeah, well, offering yourself up as a hostage is a bold move. No, that's not what I mean. She's the one who insisted I call the police. That weird. What's weird? No, nothing. Andre, can you give me a ride home? Yeah, sure, sure. I'll see you later. <laughs> That's enough. Or they'll think we're all crazy. No, they won't. I'll tell them all that you're gluey. Even Mika. You're leaving after all. Yes, mum bought part of the farm from Uncle Andre and is going to sell it to your dad. That's a shame. What's that? You'll be a rich heiress now. Because we're not going to see each other anymore. Well, what's the problem? Come visit us on vacation. I'll show you the city. I'll do it. What's the matter? <laughs> Your Alexander and I became fast friends then. I helped him build the stove. We put coins in the corners. Everything as it should be. It's a nice house. And the neighbor's not bad either. The house is good. Only. But you don't need it for anything. Are you going to Poland again? You know everything, Ivan Ivanovich. It's my job. Well, I won't waste my time if you want to sell. Then without any intermediaries, call me. We'll make a deal. We'll formalize it. Consider that beaconed. Maybe a cup of tea. Can I get a stronger one? We can make it stronger. No, I'm driving. The fact that they passed the minimum without you is a miracle. A four-turn to loop. That's awesome. Though, well, I always believed in our girls. They're starting to forget that. The most important thing in the training process is psychological preparation. Though, but you're right, the kids feel abandoned. Sophia, what do you want? Stating Union has made a schedule of competitions. The championship is in a month. Well, already, Sophia, but you... You're a great coach, and I'm sure you'll be fine. And you're a good choreographer, and together we can do it. But you know why I'm here. I know, but I don't understand. And the kids even more so. At times like this, you don't want to leave. So let's stay. What's the problem? You didn't want to stay. I didn't want to, but I did. No, Zofia is waiting for me there. She can't replace me forever. So you build a skating rink here? 
teach the village children figure skating. It's a good project. And we'll move the competitions here, which are in a month. Thank you, son. We never found out what happened to Dad. Victor killed everyone. Victor said he didn't kill Daddy. I don't know what if he... What's your point, anyway? Well, why would he lie and if not him? Then who didn't Dad himself go into the water in October? And what if Victor had an accomplice? Who did you sign the land over to? Not Victor. Good questions. I'll think about it. Ward rounds are in half an hour, so don't take too long, okay? We'll make it quick, right, Grandma? How are you? How's Andre? Everything's fine. Andre's divorced. We applied to the registry office, and in two months we're getting married, and Yulia's going abroad today, which I'm very happy about. Victor? You were right. It was him who disguised himself as a woodsman, scared people, killed Jaeger Semyonovic. The accountant, he didn't want the kluchi to be sold and processed, because there are some unique waters there. In general, everything is like in the movies, Grandma. Who killed Sasha? No one. He went into the lake for some reason. Maybe for what Sergei want the other day. Are you saying I should call Andre? Is that it? Yes, it's done. Let's go? Yes, but I wanted to say that I'm not likely to come back here. I don't want my girl to be idle, so I want you to take her for yourself. You want to give me a car? Yes. I've already re-registered it, you can use it. I'm leaving soon too. But you're still here, Olga. And then as recent events show, everything can change at the last moment, take it, or I'll be offended. All right, just know that she's always waiting for you. Serioga. Oh my god. I need to talk to you. What's wrong? I don't want to shock Olga yet. Tell me. Listen, do you remember when you went into the lake to save Yoka? Yeah. I was wondering why Sasha went into the lake. Well, here's the answer. Oh, come on. You think that Sasha drowned you, Leah? Seriously? I also at first thought this idea absurd, but then I remembered that the night Sasha drowned, I came home Yulia drank cold medicine and said that she forgave. She was freezing, and her clothes were drying outside. What does that prove? Only that she had a cold and washed her things. You don't understand, only she could have known the real value of the keys and told Victor. My dad adored Julia and could have shared that information with her. And considering how she loved Sasha and couldn't forgive her for that betrayal, and then there's me. She had every reason to hate all of us. Olga, where? She went to the airport with Yulia. I'm driving. You call Olga right away. We have to warn her. It's better to ask for forgiveness later than to be right, but it's too late. Yes, let's go. Oh, police. I wasn't speeding. All right. There, please. Sergeant Marchenko, show me your documents, please. Olga, give me, please. 
They are in the glove compartment. The car is registered to Olga Kroest. Please show me your documents. Open the trunk, please. Is it serious? Just a formality. Gaisman Alice. Alisa Gaisman. Yes? Bo. Olga, this may seem absurd, but I think I know who killed Sasha. I know too. Olga, I beg you, if you can get out of the car and wait for us, Sergei and I are on our way. I can't get out now. But I'll try to hold her off. All right. Have a good trip. Thank you. What's up? She knows Yulia's the killer and said she's gonna try to apprehend her. Damn, now she's really in danger. I wonder how she could know. Not now, guys, not now. A very buggy. To the cars. Listen, Julia. Here's the thing. The alarm went off, the security guard left the area. Nakita pulled out of school and disconnect only I can. I'll then go back to hitchhike back. And you can leave the car in the parking lot. I'll pick up later. You'll get there much faster with this car, especially since it's only 10 minutes to the airport. What about Nikita's school? It's Saturday. You got it? What are you talking about? Don't play dumb. It doesn't suit you. You can't lie. Idiot, why didn't I realize that? She's got the millions and got rid of the witness. She even insisted I go to the police. She's got it all figured out. And Victor exchanged the children for her because she had a plan. They would hide and nobody would ever find them. At least he thought so, and she decided not to share. Now there is one more witness, and if Yulia knows that Olga is on to her, she will try to get rid of her. That's why we have to catch up with them. How did you find out about the Zivi Klatschi? My father-in-law bragged. He wanted to surprise you. He asked me not to tell anyone. Did you tell Victor? Of course I did. I needed someone to do the dirty work. By the way, the idea with the woodsman was mine too. Everything went according to plan. You were supposed to sign and disappear, and I caught Andre with his mistress and after the divorce to take the Zivi Kluchi. Everything was going as planned until Andre decided to sell the farm to Kapilov. That's when I had to improvise on the fly to cancel the deal. You set Victor up on purpose. Of course I did. I need him. Can you imagine he invented that I'm in love with him? Even funny. I hate all men. They're all the same ugly. And yours too. Sasha didn't cheat on me. But he cheated on me with you. And he knew he was in love with you, so he came to the lake to console me and threw himself in the water. Sasha, I'm drowning. Sasha, I'm drowning. Sasha. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> 
Slow down, slow down. Hold on, hold on. The ambulance is on its way. I can't understand anything. We're selling the farm. We're not selling it. What do we care, as long as the curse is gone? Do you really believe in it? Zinka, you're an ancient woman. Come on, with such events you can't believe it. Colleagues, you're probably waiting for a clue as to the reason for our banquet. Of course. Let's not drag it out. Toshia and I became husband and wife an hour ago. Congratulations. Have a seat, wait a minute, wait a minute, and on this day Toshia and I wanted to ask your forgiveness for having arranged this unpleasantness with the cows. But you don't have to worry. Yesterday I finally transferred all my property rights to Olga and now she fully manages the farm. I see, the sale is cancelled again. It was already clear. Okay, Kapilov is rumored to have his eye on our landlady. So it's even possible that we'll get together. Kisses. 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 Careful, careful, don't run. Hello, Olga Nikolaevna. Oh, hello, aren't you sick of Nakita yet? No, on the contrary, it was fun. Mom, be proud, your son graduated from high school with an excellent grade. Wow, I'm proud of you and I love you. All right, let's load up. I'm also learning how to drive a combine and I'm streaming from the cab. I have half a million subscribers thanks to that. I don't even know if that's good or bad. Of course it's good. We're late for the wedding. In general, the examination confirmed that Julia purposely run the hydraulic private. She expected to have time to get to the airport. But you on the way back, the brakes will not work. But you were stopped by the police and she lost time. What about the Zivi Kluchi? Andrew is busy with them. He's running around the courts. Soon it'll be the last session. They'll decide whether the deal was legal or not. What's wrong with you? Are you sick? Stop the car. Do you want us to go back? No, no. I'm fine for a minute. Okay. Mom, I was thinking we could stay here. What about the farm? I'm selling it, right? I might not buy it. Well, then it's settled. We'll stay. Yay, hooray. 